Ready? Oh yeah. Shout out to them that I'm buying me some shoes tonight. This dude riding by me has a blue Yamaha in his mouth. So what you mean? That's a nice one, bro. That's all I need. I need to get me a car. I'm so behind in my life. All right, last store we're gonna stop for for shoes. This store usually have like hella good shoes on sale, but sometimes I get lucky, sometimes I don't get lucky. That's the thing about having big feet. When you have a size 14, 15, size 4, you might have a hard, hard ass time finding shoes that fit you and look clean. You gotta avoid trying to look like goofy or something. Let's see what we got. Trims, nice. 13s. They always have they always have your size and dress shoes, but they never have it like in just regular clean cool shoes that niggas wear. Don't nobody wanna go wearing Stacy Adams they hold all they fucking odd for me that this is nice. It's not like the ones I saw I look like they're just a little bit different though. See we got you. Brown guess I love guess man. Just wish they made shoes my fucking size. See, it's the wrong size, you need to pick the size. 13 of size 12 department. See, 12. They just don't have anything even close to my size over here. Oh, hey, good times. There was a time when I used to want to wear these, but I was like borderline gay when you wear these. Every nigga who wears these either borderline gay or a hippie or something. But then again, it might look nice. I, mean, I think these will look good on my feet. I might try to wear that. Like, I need to switch up my style. I gotta stay out of it. I, I gotta avoid being staggered in the same style of dress. I have to have to diversify myself. If that is a real word, diversify. I'm gonna Google that in a dictionary. Diversify. That might be a real word. Let's see. Well, these are nice. I don't know if I could fit these, though. I don't think I can fit these, though. They're 13. Maybe I can fit them. Can your boy fit them? Can you fit them? Shall see. Can your boy fit them? Can the shoes be fit? And survey says no. We might have action. We might have action and okay. Size 13, your boy for the size 13. Ooh. Hey, bro, yeah. random question because you dress pretty fresh. Yeah. Think, yeah or nay? They're very nice. Mm. I would wear them. Yeah, I don't know. I'm thinking to like them, but I don't know for sure because then I got to get a whole new wardrobe for, for some right, shoes right. like this. Appreciate it. Excuse me, man. Excuse me. Well, I'm just opinion. Think these are cool right now. Mm. Okay, got two yeses. Two yeses, I see you. I'm from London, so they're good. Are you from London? Yeah. Oh, cool. So good. Well, thank you. Gotta trust a person from London. They always have the best sense of style. Mm. Should I get them? Yeah, man. Hmm. I gotta close my eyes and pretend if I never wore these shoes before. One, two, three. I think I'm gonna get these ones. I like them. I think I'm gonna get them. Gotta switch my style up a little bit. But then I don't know. I need $26, but I gotta get these, man. $26 for a pair of these. This has been so long since I found shoes that fit me that actually look nice. Like, let's see what I'm wearing. But then I gotta get some, I gotta get these and get some khakis on. Probably gotta get some khaki shorts for these too. Man. Okay. These are 12, so I can't mess with those. Let's see what else we got in there. The only thing I don't like about these, I wish they were just a little bit more or less.
So I failed to find shoes, but I did find Cologne, Kenneth Cole reaction. You know, if Kenneth Cole happens to be watching, if Kenneth Cole actually a real person, I've never thought about that. But if he happens to be watching this right now, this podcast, this YouTube vlog is sponsored by Kenneth Cole Reaction. Do you want to smell good enough for a woman to stop in the store and say, you know what? Your chocolate skin, delectable, delectable little boy, I always love to look at from the toes to the bottom. And buy Kenneth Cole Reaction, the best cologne money can buy. So, nos estamos, nuestra mexicana. Los que estamos comiendo un bean burrito sin algo, sin queso, porque yo soy vegan. Y nos estamos comiendo una taco de peche. And some chips. You know, first thing, one thing you gotta learn about your boy, one thing I learned about your boy is I love Mexican food. Like, I love Mexican food almost as much as I love Mexican women. And I love Mexican women almost as much as I love black women. I love black women almost as much as I love black keys on the piano. So, Slippery spoke to me. And one thing I do like about coming to restaurants like this is because when you go here, all you see is nothing but Mexican people. And it's always cool to come somewhere where like this, you see like literally like totally different coach. Like there's a nigga, there's literally like a nigga with a fedora on the back, like it's funny as hell, you know? He really has a fedora, like this is the 1960s. Look, I'm gonna eat. I'm talking about with our later. I'm about to hit Marshalls in a minute. See what's up over there. Mm.